Hey, Dana. Hey, welcome to my blog. And this is, I just bought it. When I find something or uh, I buy something to try, um, I usually put it up. And I've been doing a couple of ear um, Wi-Fi or Bluetooth hearing hearing plugs. And now I've decided I'm going to go ahead and try the earmuffs. See, I don't... I don't really work out with those or anything like that. I usually lawn, mow my lawn. So I usually put those under a set of earmuffs. So I found a set of earmuffs that basically hi-fi, they're Bluetooth, you play three, three uh, MP3s, uh, telephone, or and they also have a NRR which is your quietness uh, 24 DB so whatever the outside noise is it'll cut it down 24 24 DB connect wireless hearing protectors and we will try these out because the last last pair I tried yeah, last pair I tried they weren't weren't good enough the other, um, the uh, travelocities are perfect. If you got a system around your neck and you got the earplugs, um, probably going to be a good system to use. Um, exactly sure how these. They run about $50, $55. They're pretty heavy. Okay, bottom of them, they got the got your plug in probably to char uh probably got a charge charge plug. Oh, it comes with it. <laughs> Charging book. I've got thousands of these now. <laughs> oh. And they're all basically the same too. Um, I just found that my Bluetooth speaker that I use at work actually will use the uh, the Android charging plug. You just got to turn it up down and plug it in. So. These are, you know, they're these are big and bulky, but um, you know, not that. okay, click. So there we go. Let's see what they look like once they're plugged in. Can give me a charging indicator. Yeah. Got a, got a got a blue charging indicator here. Not sure how long they have to be charged. I've had these probably a good six months now because I've been trying the other other sets out. Let's see what's it say for charging time on those. Connect wireless hearing protectors. Charging the headset to comply with regulation. LED, LED will blink blue while charging and change to solid blue when it's completed. And voice, and, uh, voice assist announces on or power off. Voice assist will provide a battery status update, higher, medium, or low. Or battery empty. Adjust the volume using your connected device. Okay. Uh, let's see. Low battery warning. 
Hearing protector will also provide a low battery hearing every 20 minutes when the battery voltage is low. In addition, battery empty warning will occur as hearing protector powers down. Recharge the powder at this time. Dad? Yes. Okay, and then uh, auto shut off five minutes after either Bluetooth or audio input is disconnected, the hearing protector will automatically power down. After auto shut off, press and hold on off button three seconds to burn, turn it back on. And of course you can use this for shooting. You can use this for anywhere anywhere you need to go uh, it's like pairing the device once power on double press the button on the hearing protectors right cup to enter pairing mode we'll hear Bluetooth pairing on make sure your Bluetooth is enabled on your device and scanning check the device to make sure it has discovered work tunes connect and select work tunes connect to connect to the hearing protector once connect connected successfully you will hear Bluetooth connected the LED on the right cup will turn blue your Bluetooth audio volume will be connected by your device next time you power up your hearing protector will automatically connect your device and say Bluetooth connect. Most, most of them do. Um, you can push forward, forward or back, or pause, play. To pause or play audio on the device, you can single press the button on the right cup to advance tracks, double press the button and triple press to select the next track. If if you're in, in my, my case I use Pandora, um, it may or may not go forward or backwards. You have to buy the premium for that, which is about $4.99 a month, but you know, I just do it free. Uh, Bluetooth mode, incoming calls will, be, will cause the music to be muffed. You will enter your, uh, and you will hear your phone ringtone until the call has ended. To answer the incoming call, press the button on the hearing protector once. To disconnect from it, press the button once more. After disconnecting from the call, you will hear call terminated. To reject a call or return to Bluetooth mode, press and hold the button. After rejecting the call, you will hear call terminated. Um, connect wireless hearing protector Bluetooth range uh, it says approximately 25 feet and that's probably um, in line or vision distance will depend on the device as the distance between the Bluetooth device and the hearing protector is increased risk of signal dropout will increase best results keep the Bluetooth device and body within arm's length. And it also has a connector. If you have a dual dual end, I don't know if I got one. No, I don't have one right here. But it looks like that. It'll have one of these on both ends, so you can plug one in your earplug, earplug hole on your device on your device. And plug the other one into um, into the other hole right here, so you can go direct if you want. And that's about it. Other than make sure you have your phone um, set to low when you're uh, when you fire that up. I don't think my my Android um, won't let it be in high high volume unless I choose to the minute it plugs in it'll be at a low and then you can just adjust it to the high so anyway thanks for watching I'll be doing a um,
a final evaluation on this and in a month or so and I will let you know of course how it works for me so thanks for watching don't forget to comment subscribe definitely share